Hey Whistle Out family, today I am giving you a Whistle Out how-to where I show you how to do easy but potentially confusing tasks on your cell phone. Today I'm showing you how to check your data usage on your T-Mobile account if you're a T-Mobile customer. I'm gonna show you how to do this in two ways, plus at the end of the video, I'm gonna tell you why doing this regularly could potentially save you lots of money. If this video ends up helping you or you just wanna see more videos from me or Whistle Out, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and of course, turn on those notifications. I'd love to have you around a little bit more. Now let's jump into the meat of this video. Like I said before, I'm giving you two ways to check data on your T-Mobile account. The first way is through dialing a phone number, but for all of you anxious phone people out there, including me, don't worry, you don't have to talk to anybody on the phone. It literally just sends you a message, so I'll show you what number to dial. And the second way is through the T-Mobile app, and there are one billion T-Mobile apps in the app store, so I'll help you figure out which app is the correct one and how to navigate it to find your data usage. Let's get to it. First things first, T-Mobile will let you know for the most part if you have used up a certain amount of data from your plan. For instance, they'll send you a text message at 80% of usage and at 100% usage. So just be aware that T-Mobile will have your back a little bit. They will be sending you messages when your data is almost out. But if you wanna check your data before that happens, then keep watching, this is how to do it. Like I said, the first option is to dial a simple phone number. So open up your T-Mobile device, whatever it may be. Then just dial the number pound, nine, three, two, pound, the end, that's it. It doesn't even ring, it just opens up a screen which will show you your data usage. If you have the T-Mobile app downloaded, it will direct you to the T-Mobile app and show you the correct screen where your data usage is displayed. So you don't have to click lots of buttons, you can just dial a number and it'll open it up exactly where you need to. One thing to note here is that when you dial the number, it only shows your data usage for the billing period. It doesn't give you any information from previous billing periods uh, or hotspot usage. So if you wanna check out more of those details, now it's time to go on to option number two, downloading the T-Mobile app and navigating to the right part where you can check your data. So let's go over that. Now I kind of joked before, but let's just take a scroll through the app store and I'll show you how many T-Mobile apps there are. There are so many, like this should all be all in one app. There shouldn't be 10 million different apps for all of these T-Mobile applications, but here we are. The one you're gonna to wanna to download is just the straight T-Mobile app, nothing fancy. It just says T-Mobile, no additional directions or anything like that on it, just the T-Mobile app. Now, once you download that basic T-Mobile app, you're just gonna to have to sign in using your account information. You might need to reset your password. I know I need to reset my password often for problems like this, but once you get in, you will open up to a very basic home screen on the T-Mobile app. And to navigate to your data usage, just follow these steps. You need to tap plans and usage details. At the top of that screen, you're gonna tap usage and there you will see a breakdown of numbers with showing you data usage, text message usage, and call times and hotspot review. And then from there, you can dive deeper into all of these separate numbers and see where you're spending the most time, maybe on which apps, who you're texting the most, <laughs> how much data you've spent in this billing period and in previous billing periods. So there is a lot you can break down inside the T-Mobile app compared to dialing the number. Where, the, where dialing the number might be quicker, opening the app gives you a much more broad look at your overall usage. Now this brings me on to the last part of this video, which is why should you check your data or why would you be checking your data? Now, first and foremost, the main reason I tell people to check their data and check it regularly at least once a month to see how much data you're using is because it's 2021, why are we overpaying for things we don't use? And by that I mean most of us have unlimited plans, but most of us don't need those unlimited plans. So if you're not using your plan to its fullest potential, why are you paying 70, 80, 90 dollars a month for a cell phone plan when you could be spending half that on a plan that is more catered to your data usage? So just going over your last three months, maybe add those together and find the average and see how much data you're using. Then you can see if maybe a new plan is on the horizon for yourself. That's reason number one why you should be checking your data regularly. Another reason why you might want to check your data is just to see how much you have left. If you're not on an unlimited plan and you're on a plan that maybe will charge you for going over your data usage, it's a good thing to keep an eye on your data usage 
day by day, week by week to make sure you're not gonna get dinged for the extra 10 or $15 per gigabyte you're using because that can add up if you are not careful. That's it for this whistle out how to. If you have any questions about using your T-Mobile app or where to find the data usage, then let me know in the comments below. I did use an iPhone for this demonstration, but if you have an Android phone, it should be very similar, if not exactly the same. So if you do have questions, don't be afraid to ask in the comments below or reach out to us on any social media platform. I'm Sherry Riggs with Whistle Out. Thanks for watching Whistle Out TV.